Welcome back everyone, Drake Hawkins with again for some more Surviving Mars. We uh, finished off this mystery, I'm not sure why it keeps popping up here, but go away mystery. We beat you Metatron. Humanity beat you. Um, we have uh, been working on getting the domes cleaned up up here, getting them more usefully designed. Uh, I wanted to put in <coughs> some uh, creative alleys in here. Why? Are they necessary? No. Are they a good idea? Probably not. Do I want to do it anyways? Yep. There we go. Uh, they got rock gardens and they got paths. So each of them only has a ranch, which if they dismantle it, it's only a little bit of stuff to repair it. What does it cost to build an indoor ranch? Um, that's a machine part, five metals and ten concrete. So as long as they run a few runs of food, that's fine. I'm giving them an outdoor ranch here as well. And then the polymers factory as soon as we have the machine parts. Which is kind of the point right now. We've got uh, electronics finally, so I'm going to shut off this uh, night shift for them. Let people diversify their work elsewhere. <clears throat> um, in here, we have the uh, upgrade in the works. Nearly done. Just some polymers to finish that baby up. Uh, and then we'll have the, uh, there it is, holographic scanner online. Now, they should make babies a little faster in this dome this way. Which is great. I'm actually thinking of getting rid of the ranch in here. I think that's what we're going to have to do. In fact, it's mid-swing mid, mid swing and we're going to do it anyways. Uh, we'll let people work a little more here. And I'm going to switch this to going back to doing seed because we have tons of food. 500 and some right now. Uh, that's at 100, so I'm going to switch that to uh, seed as well and this one to giant potatoes. Uh, and down here... We can do, uh, we can, well, <clears throat> we can do that one like that. Let that pass by a little bit. Give them a chance to work in there as well. Now, uh, the point here is I want to, uh, <clears throat> pardon me, today I want to make sure that we get uh, some important things online. We have, no, we don't have enough polymers to turn that off. Uh, I want to make sure this baby dome is actually babying nicely. Uh, do we, did we do the tech for the housing? This magic fancy housing we didn't okay let's do that uh, smart homes require five electronics and 15 concrete to make and they actually house 12 instead of 14 that's fine though we have half a billion dollars uh, I think we do have no no it doesn't look like we do I was gonna say I think we do have some celebrity money coming in here but I guess not uh, still down on the polymers in a number of areas uh, we do have fuel for said polymers, right? And yeah, not a lot. You guys can go back online. Both of you went to repaired. Uh, the machine parts factory down here is uh, okay. It's not doing stellar, but it could be upgraded. Let's do the 20% upgrade on him. Uh, we cut out the two electronics factories over here, so we should only be doing like 8 or 10. 6.7. Hmm. Need more... Uh, or you guys operational. I'm gonna bring them back online. Uh, we got apartments up the wazoo over here. This is the university training zone, right? So this dome is... Is there any specialist needed in this dome at all? Medics can be in here. I guess we could have security officers, but we really don't use them. Uh, if I were to put back in that... Uh, where is it? the casino but not started yet I might return that to its function um, one two three four five apartments yeah, it's all right it's not, it's not a stellar dome I'm thinking of getting rid of these small grocers I don't care for them at all they could, they've been doing just about nothing most of the time so uh, we could replace them with a with a, a garden each. That'd be lovely use of the space. I guess I can turn things up a little. Eh? There we go. We'll do that. Oh, I hate when he does when I don't hit the right button. There you go. Okay, so that's online. That's online. I think we're gonna put in uh, smart homes in this area, in this this dome. And uh, for now, this one will be focused on baby making. The comfort is high enough. Uh, I think we're encouraging the sexies here. Yeah, we only have five, but... Um, uh, well, 
I guess this these are renegade domes, so if we have no sexies allowed in that one. And no sexies allowed in that one for now. Then they should all be in here eventually. Yeah? Good. Okay, services or uh, equipment and materials wise, we are very desperately low on water and uh, water source. This, these sources are the only thing we have and that is already almost half done in like two episodes. That was just started, but it's not going to last long. So, we're going to bring this guy over here. I'd like, uh, I'd like a machine part delivery. That'd be great. We are still very low on, on products. We're just kind of coming back out of our crazy busy slump there. Making 7.1 electronics and 8.6 machine parts with everything operational and upgraded. And the polymers factory here is making 7.6. Okay. Not a problem. We got, uh, we just need a little polymers there and a little, uh, what, a little machine parts there. No, a little, yeah, machine parts and polymers. And those will be back online. Looks like our power system's gone back online as well. I like it. Uh, why are you needing repair if you're in a scrub zone? Mm -hmm. Interesting. Uh, I have no, no drone coverage there, do I? I don't. Oh, bother. Oh, bother. Oh, bother. Well, um... Wouldn't hurt to have another drone, right? Uh, also wouldn't hurt to have this guy scrubbed. He's three electronics. I'm, I'm iffy about that. I know it's been mentioned to do it, but reality is... I don't know that it's necessary. Uh, getting rid of this set again as well. Because again, they are not... Uh, scrubbed, so... They're just gonna be... A waste and I can put in a few electronics when the time comes <clears throat> and that'll let us build them a lot quicker or use power more efficiently I guess is the way you say that. There we go. Bit of a project to clean that all up but we're getting faster at it. Alright now having done that we need to consider what we're gonna do about this water source here. For now, I think I'm going to delete these, and we're going to dismantle that one, because I didn't realize they're outside of the uh, repair zone. Could put in a new repair zone, but I think what we'll do is we'll go in and we'll get some more moisture vaporators. Wait a second, where's his range? Uh, oh, come on. Select the building. There we go. Alright, so in line with that. Alright, uh, can we do... No, no. Can we do moisture vaporators? Like this. I know these things are not spread, and it's like, oh well, it's such a waste. But in reality, the output they produce, or in my opinion, I should say, the output they produce it more than makes up for uh, with all their upgrades and everything, and being, oh, thundering toddlers, uh, and they're being. Uh, um, can you get up here and fix this, please? Um, there's, you can just spam them out, basically, is what, is what I'm saying. You can just spam them out. You're over there, huh? Hmm. You have no pipes? What? Oh. I didn't realize the pipe, I said that went in backwards. Alright. We are cranking through the water here into our giant storage devices that will then empty out. So we definitely have to prioritize this. I think that's our that's our kicker. We have to prioritize that. Um, you can come over here for a moment. Quirky, you're not busy at the moment, so you're going to come up top. Take care of stuff over here. Now, uh, do I need electronics here? If I'm, if I'm putting another scrubber in, I do. I can clean this space and make a giant water facility up here. Uh, yeah... I think we will. Let's do that. Let's make this our primary water tank for water production. Uh, to do so, I'm going to have to uh, landscape this area, though. Uh, okay, that was not what I expected it to do. You can just tweak it down a little bit at a time without oh, without making a project. Um, by uh, 
anything. Anything that drops less than one whole unit of, or consumes one less than one whole unit of waste rock. And I'm just trying to really be finicky here and get these nice and flat. That there. Excellent. That can go next. Uh, there, please. And you turn scrubber up to full. Perfect. All right, so they can now handle the great dust storm. That's excellent. Uh, truck is still working here, huh? Need a lot more than that. Okay, you're gonna dismantle. Actually, no, wait a second. Don't dismantle. Just put you to demand none and build a new one. All over the map, guys. That's how we roll. You get up there, and you can demand everything. This is now no longer demanding. Good. Good, good, good. Rockets on their way. Look at them launching. They're amazing. Little jump rockets. Jump shuttles. Okay, so this will work, right? And now I can just put the power line in here. Like so. And now we've got the new water coming online. Now these guys are thankfully infinite in their water production, so that's good. I really do want something there, but we might have to we might have to put another uh, another drone hub at some point. We're gonna probably have lake activity going on up here. Um, since the water's already here, it's probably a smart idea. Auto save. How are the uh, nerds and freaks doing? Well, they're blowing their own buildings up. Well, I'm okay with you blowing apartments up. There we go. Polymers online. We can go uh, all night, all day on crazy shifts, and that's fine with me. You can go out your outdoors. So you can do all the upgrades, and that's excellent. Now. Bring me more polymers over there when you're done that, please. That'll be groovy. Okay, so. <clears throat> now this dome is supposed to be having... Um, well, it's really having issues with getting its polymer. We're just, we're, we have so much polymer being consumed that the one factory is not keeping up. I'm wondering where all of that polymer consumption is from. Let's check that our uh, scrubber areas are properly cleaning everything. Looks like that's fine. This area is just concrete pads that don't need to be used anymore. Uh, let's go here and grab all the things and bring them up to here, please. Uh, this section, is it being scrubbed properly still? Everything... Wait a second, what's going on there? Oh, it's just grayed, and I can't see it because it's really hard to see on the on the ice. The heaters are operational, yes. Lasers on. Mm-hmm. I think it's time to get rid of this stuff. These ones under here, they are scrubbed, but I want to turn them into... Uh, um, I gotta put wind in here. No point in having the... Uh, it's solar and it's so poor and it's only going to get worse as we terraform alright so wind upgrades since we have the mm, the machine parts come in nicely now uh, somebody somebody hi somebody please someone get rid of that just taking too long, guys. Thank you. Now, lake. No on here, but that would cramp the space. Okay. That and that would work. Fine, I guess. Cold wave okay. approaching. Uh, indeed. Okay, well. Couldn't get off that long without an, some sort of negative event happening, right? They're, they're filling the holes in with wind. Bam, bam, bam! Look at that! <clears throat> Machines everywhere. Now, the other thing is, if we can possibly get some polymers stored, that would be great. You, you have fuel, right? 
Where is all the polymer going? Is it still just going into repairs? Rebuildings? I mean, these guys each take five, so that's part of the suck. The drain. And then the vector and the upgrade. Man, it's just polymers all over the place for those plays. Uh, let's extend this, since we can. <clears throat> I guess we just let them go. Like, maybe we put a night shift and do the crazy on them, but as well. But uh, you're going to be top priority. You guys are producing 5.2. Okay, in spite of being renegades. How are we doing up here? We got. We can put the shifts open, so they'll do a little more researching. Uh, how close are we to... Oh, we're still doing other treatment stuff, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I'm thinking we move smart homes to the top. And then uh, rejuvenation treatment actually can bump it above it. There we go. <coughs> smart homes take how long? 7,000. Okay, and rejuvenation is 10. No problem. Why? What? 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 Seriously, don't. Seriously, polymers. <clears throat> we need a lot of it. <laughs> it needs to be, like, this is harsh work. Outdoors, overclocked, and still not getting the polymers in. I don't have, like, s like people selling polymers as gift at gift shops, do we? I think those are all off. They better be. <laughs> They're all—it's all going into these things and upgrades, I guess. I don't know. Maybe at some point they queued up a bunch of upgrades. Damn, we're gonna need hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of polymers in order to make that thing run. <clears throat> okay, we got the farm going. Uh, outdoor farms have a different set, so they can do goats. That's uh, 1.5 water, two oxygen. 4 water, 2.5 oxygen. 3 water, 4.5 oxygen. It's 300 food and 12 souls. Ostrich is 2 water, 3 oxygen. 8 souls, huh? 8 to 12, 5. So 5, so 20 per soul. This is um, 15 per soul. <clears throat> Although the water use for goats is much lower. Oh, pardon me. Hey, yawn. What the heck, Drake? What the heck? I'm not even tired right now. It's, it's the beginning of a recording session. What's going on, my friend? What's going on? Uh, 12 souls to make 300 is 25 per soul. 150 over 8 souls is 18 and a quarter and 3 quarters. So this is the highest... Cows, obviously. The highest yield of food per soul takes 3 water. 4, 1.5... I think we'll probably leave them on the goats for now. Uh, did I just switch it? Are we just butchering all the goats and culling the crop, or what? They all just went in. Oops. I guess I did. <laughs> My bad. Uh, really? Really a bunch of rare metals just sitting around? Hmm. Can we put a rare metal storage down there and then remove them? Thanks. Uh, how are we doing on rare metals? 77, huh? Uh, the eternal pause would ironically be a great choice to do automated route flights. <laughs> so the point of flying, why would you want money? Well, at this point, I want money because the money is going to give me research. And that's really all that, that matters. <clears throat> you got to get over there and repair him. Oh, so much goes goes on, so much all the time. How are we doing on population? Back up to 197, almost cracking the 200 mark again. Uh, the uh, that's terrible that that's the Keith. That's the <laughs> resources still. are low. Um, Australia is 30, Crazy Town is 16. I'm okay if those domes become obsolete. If they wear out and have nothing nothing going on, I'm totally fine with that. Why do we have unemployed here? Really? How do you have unemployed people there? That's called renegating at the next to the next level. You you don't work. Oh, can't work? Now you're middle-aged, unemployed. Well, you're gonna have a sanity breakdown. 
probably like suicide or something stupid. Oh look at all the goats! Goats are amazing. They're so happy in our Martian domes. <laughs> That's awesome. Alright. <clears throat> we uh I wanna put in more housing here, but this place is nowhere near needing it. There's only twenty-four people in this dome. Nineteen there. A hundred and why is there a hundred and two people in here? Oh, is it because it's preferring something? Preferring non-specialists. Okay. That's fine. We need them to uh, to university. They can come over. They're coming over here to work anyway. So, so the sanatorium should take care of any bad deals they've got. I'm gonna switch that to auto. So hopefully that'll improve curing. 64 have been cured over the lifetime of that place. We are legitimately like full up almost on these apartments. It's amazing. Um, small art stores, they're still gonna stay off. I'm not gonna put that back on. Not anytime soon, that's for sure. Another building destroyed, huh? Well, prepare it with your concretes. Why are we. Hmm. take the waste rock and you put it up here. Uh, that's interesting. I forgot about the cold front, cold wave hitting. How are we doing there? Are you guys going to keep running in the cold? You are. See, they're making .6 only right now, but once upgraded, they make, uh, I don't know if I've got any over here upgraded. They don't, they don't lose, I think this 50% stack doesn't, I don't know, I think this .4 is not actually a full loss. I don't think it's 40% less. I think it loses a flat point four. Could be wrong. Correct me if I'm wrong, but if it is if it is a flat well I'll check it, I'll upgrade one. Because if the percentage builds on top of that, then it's not great. If it's one water minus point four, if one is the base then the multiplier should be on top of the 1. If 0.6 is the base that they calculate off, then then we have problems. Then the upgrades might not be magically awesome. But the polymer count cost is huge. Uh, we're making 14, we got 21 in store, so we're actually we actually should have everybody repaired with ample supply now. That's good. Um, we have 102 seeds. We could get our seed factories going again. They won't work in the cold, though. Oh, got a pause. Eternal pause, huh? Um, okay. Okay, 1.1. See? 1.1 gives a is a 50% boost of the one base. So it is how I thought I was hoping. Um, it, th if this didn't... Basically because there's other ones in range, it loses 0.4, period. Its base number that it uses these multipliers off of is, um, is 1. So 1 times 50% is 0.5, so it adds 0.5. Its base loses 0.4, so it's 1.1 instead of 1.5. With the upgrade. So totally worth doing cramming them in. I M H O. All of you guys get that. <clears throat> go go hog, guys. Go hog. Do we did we ever build a uh, um a drone making machine factory? Did I ever build that? Uh no, I didn't research it. Uh okay. Really like to be able to get more drones going. And more vehicles, for that matter. But more drones going would be amazing. Hmm. Before any of these, I don't know. I need I need money cranking in. So maybe what we do is focus on the money side of things. Like I could do that, right? Instead of these. 
You do this one, have our extractors go 50% more. Cost 15,000. Or I could do this. Cost 20,000. I think the Project Mohole is the way to go. I am going to do smart homes to make these uh, this place even more awesome to make babies. There's just not enough people here. You know what? I'm going to tell this one to not prefer specialists and let them disperse. Let them distribute themselves evenly back across. Look at them all. Pouring through the domes to be like, I'd prefer to live over here where all the sexy people are. That'd be nice. Maybe they'll think I'm sexy. Um. Yeah, okay. Heat and water is working. The cold wave really doesn't hurt us that badly. Our, our power supply is dropping, but... Uh, oh. No, sword power is good. 10k still. Uh, so we've got to kind of crank up our power supply, but... How much polymers are we going to need to do all this? Oh, never mind. It's all done. Meteor shower. So each time. of these are now producing 1.1 instead of 0.6, which is the 50% on the base of one boost. Uh, we're now cranking out a lot of water from these guys. So if these are all 1.1, uh, so it's 2.1 because I gave him the update. So yeah, you Meteor do get the full. So the, oh boy. Oh, oh, not great. Not good at all. Well, I mean. It's not terrible, as long as it's down here. As long as it doesn't bang around up in the base itself. We have lasers back up line, online? <laughs> I don't remember. Uh, we did put laser turrets back on, yes? Yes, we did, okay. One, anyways. Where's the other one? He's in there. He's hiding. Alright, um... Power-wise, we could actually make up for the lot for the. I know we should delete all those ones. We can actually make up for the um, uh, for the negative power right now just by polymering up a handful of blades. Not a, not even a lot would be needed to make it work. There we go. Zooming in like that because I don't want to be like trying to click here and I have, to have it actually click, you know, on the hop on the and the you know the fan the turbine or something and that would be sad, very sad. Or delete like a uh, the water thing and never be able to build it again. That would be also super sad. That tech is one I want to do. It's been I've been harped at about that one for quite a while to get the uh, what's it called um, nano refinement. Technology, I think it's called. It's the one that re lets your um, deposits continue to trickle even after they've been exp uh, expended entirely. Sword power's down to 1200. Well, that's bad. Very bad. Um, and I just deleted all the solar there. Okay, uh, not great. Might move those. So I don't. I think this stuff up here. Maybe we'll make sure all these are are uh, laid it up. I thought they might be. I thought I saw one, that was one or two that weren't. Okay, that stuff is new, so it needs to be upgraded. Let's just upgrade all of those small ones. And although that's kind of polymers, but it's done now, so we'll leave it. Alright, we're 473 negative. Okay, so I could actually just tell these two, like, I could drop some of the power need, but that's only a little bit of it, so it's not a lot. Not a lot. How are we doing on power? Do we, are we out yet? We are out. Entirely out of power. Uh, okay. Well, um... Yeah, those could all be low. That would be fine for now. But things like that are definitely low priority. Your housing can be low priority. Oh, wait. Not all of it. Nope, not all of it. That's a bad idea. I, I forgot that's not just that dome's worth of housing. Um... 
You're fixed up. Um, we have regular. No, we got apartments in here too. Okay. Uh, I did. I disconnected the power, unfortunately, from that scrubber. That is very sad. Uh, oxygen, yeah, that can be off for sure. Pull you down. That's good. Uh, in the water, do we have stored water? 3,000 stored water. You guys can be lower. Okay, now. Power-wise, we're 320. Are we getting the polymers in? We ha we could put in more machine parts, more direct power. Research line, uh, complete. More power directly in, that would be good. Uh, how's our scrubber range here? Scrubber's there, huh? Like that, and I think there's still somebody there, hiding on me. That one works. And then there. We just go up the line here. Okay. Yes, we can fit some. It's in the way. Power power cable in the way? Oh yeah, that's fine. We can relocate that for sure. Okay. Now, um, I think what we need to do is is uh the Funding cash thing, received. yeah, I was just gonna say the cash thing's gonna start happening, uh, and then we can start using it for um, outsourcing right away. And that is, there's no other purpose for it at this point in the game because it just costs you so much. Um, how much are these producing? This thing producing for so? Oh, it's overclocked and it's night shifted. Oh, baby. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Well, maybe not except that accessible. Okay, so that's going to keep him full. Like we can, one of those is plenty to do the job. Um, to keep the rocket full. Uh, we can fit one in there and one in there if we get rid of the power. Um, We just need the machine parts to roll. Again, those auto building tech is amazing. I love it. There we go, there's another one. And it's now connected, so we can go ahead and get rid of this line. Put in another turbine in here. These things run huge long term power, and they get better as the technology goes up. Um, the amount of power when you start gaining atmosphere, the amount of power they generate goes up. Likewise, when you start gaining water, the amount of uh, moisture vaporator production goes up. Meteor incoming. Meteor incoming. You need to leave, dude. Right away. Oh, that was very not just a lot of spare time you had there. Where is the storm? I thought it was down here. No? No meteor storm? Hmm. Alright, maybe there isn't one. Well, look at that. We're way over time. What a surprise. Uh, Power-wise, we're now positive. I think the cold wave is... The cold wave has passed. Power is positive. We're good for quite a while again. So these things should crank up in... Well, ridiculously fast. They're inputting. They're actually charging at a rate of 46.6 a piece. And there's 10 of them? Yeah, because we have 20,000 capacity, so there's 10 of them, and they're charging it. We're, we're cranking in 465, right? So that's what's going into the chargers. All right. I think that's enough of the polymers, and I think, or enough of the those guys, and I think the uh, we need to keep upgrading the water supply here for sure. Uh, we'll stretch it out next episode and expand that, expand on that, but I also want to make sure that all of these get their vector pumps. Now, if you guys want to uh, debate over that, my decision on these in the comments, go ahead. But um, just to recap, uh, right now, without the vector pump, this one is making 1.1. Without the base upgrade, they were making 0.6. So they go from 0.6 to, to 1.1, which is a 0.5 increase. 
the uh, hygroscopic coating gives a 50% of the base, which is 1, not 0. 0.6. So because the way it calculates that, these are still worth having nicely packed in and crowned in, because this whole set here is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15 of them already, and they're producing, they'll be producing 2.1 water piece. So we're already at 30, 30 something water, 32 it, almost water production. 32.5, maybe? No, we're almost at 32 water production without these guys operating. So, it's pretty OP. Uh, you are frozen. Gotcha. You're on a fro- Oh, no! You're both frozen from the storm because I shut you off, and we don't have heaters. <laughs> nuts. Um, I suppose putting a heater in temporarily is a good idea. Oh, man! Didn't realize I was doing that. You guys are probably screaming at me. L rightfully so. Very just screamage. There, that's for sure. Uh, and then that in there. Okay. They'll run very low. They will consume water. So I'll just turn found. them on. Oh, what? Oh, a meteor anomaly? Oh, yeah. There's the meteor storm. Why is it up there now? I am very confused where this meteor storm has been. I, hit, I saw them hit down here and up here and now up here. I'm confused. But anyways, we got to get out of here today. Thank you, everybody, for joining me. We'll see you in game.